Hey everyone, so here's another linear equation, uh, like question from a linear equation, and the question is the difference between the two number is seven, six times the smaller plus larger is seventy-seven. Find the numbers. So they're talking about two numbers whose difference is seven. So let us assume the numbers first. So here is a solution. So let two numbers. B, A and B. So here we are assuming that A is less than B. Means A is a smaller number and B is a greater number. Now, according to the first question or first statement, we can say we said that difference between two number is seven. Means B minus A will be equal to seven. So according to question. B minus A is equal to seven, and from here, what I going to do here is I going to transpose A to the other side. Why we going to do this? I will explain the next step. So for B will become seven plus A. Let us take it as a first equation, or you can just leave it like that. It's on you. If you want to take an equation, you can take it as a first equation. Let us come to second condition. So second condition is six times the smaller. Six times the smaller means six times the smaller number. In that case, it becomes six x plus the larger larger number. Okay, six x. It's not a six x. It's six a. So we're going to take it as six a plus the larger number, which is b, is nothing but seventy seven. This is a second equation we got it. Now. What we have to do here is we have to get the value of a and b. But we know that b is equal to seven plus a. So what I'm going to do here is in place of b, I'm going to substitute seven plus a. So substitute b is equal to seven plus a. In this is my second equation. So in equation two. So after doing that, we'll get six a plus in place of b, I'm placing seven plus a is equal to seventy seven. Now from here we can add the variable six a plus a will be seven a seven a, and we can transpose this seven to the other side. It becomes seventy seven minus seven. Now seventy seven minus seven is seventy. So from here we can write down seven a is equal to seventy. Which implies a will be equal to seventy upon seven. So we can cancel. We'll get a is equal to ten. So therefore, a is equal to ten. So we got the smaller number, which is equal to ten. Now to get the b value, we're going to use the equation a, equation one. That is, b is equal to seven plus a. Now since b is equal to seven plus a, and we know a value is ten, so seven plus ten will be equal to Seventeen. So therefore, b is equal to seventeen and a is equal to ten. I hope it's clear to you. If you have a question or doubt, you can leave a comment below. And thank you so much for watching this.